Oh. If you don't get out of my video in 2.5 seconds, I'm going to throw five candles at you. Hey guys, it's me, Val. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys a candle haul. Alright, so I know that all the rave is all about Bath & Body Works or Yankee Candles. But today, today, as you guys saw in my last video, I did a Dollar Tree shopping spree. So if you've been living under a rock, you wouldn't know that Walmart has some pretty cheap candles. And they are $3.88. $3.33? I don't know, I think 3.33. But anyway, they have a candle brand named Mainstays. For one thing is, um, I love Bath & Body Works. Like, but the thing with Bath & Body Works is I am allergic. I'm a little bit allergic and it really does suck. If they're not like in a super huge open space, then I will just get all kinds of symptoms and it really sucks. But anyway, Walmart has saved the day. Um, I found these candles, which I've always known about them. Um, if you haven't, I don't know where you've been living, like I said, under a rock. But these are the... These are the mainstay candles. Um, first of all, they're pretty small. They do burn for a very good long time, very long time. I think even more than the Bath & Body Works. If those, you can burn through them like that. And who doesn't want to save a buck? Like. So my little hack is that you buy yourself a bunch of candle hoarder, oh, hoarder, me. You, that you buy yourself a bunch of candle holders, like really cute ones, kind of like the ones from Bath and Body Works, if you want, like the silver ones or the cute little, um, you know what I'm talking about, candle holders, the holders. You can find them on Amazon everywhere, and pop one of these in there, light it. No one would ever know that you are saving a lot of money. Because those are what, like $22.50 and these are $3.33. So anyway, um, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the ones that I picked up. I'm super obsessed. They all smell so good. I have eight candles to share with you guys. I picked up a lot of them because it's that time of season where you just want to like chill and light a candle. I like to like, I don't know, I like when I wake up in the morning and just like clean the house. Um, clean the house and then you just want it to smell good so I'm I can light candles every single day in every room my daughter's the same my husband's the same so I mean come on these are super cheap okay so I'm just gonna shut up and get right into everything first of all the only downside is that they don't have the notes on the candle so I'm gonna try to describe to you which I'm pretty bad about doing I can't give directions I can't describe things like if there's a camera in front of me I'll be like there's a box like I, I can't I can't do that type of stuff anyway so the first one that we have here is pumpkin spice I'm not a huge pumpkin spice lover oh this one smells so freaking good it smells super sweet not sickly sweet um it smells so good I can't this one smells delicious it smells like straight up pumpkin pie and like you can almost smell the whipped cream if that makes sense it's very creamy it's like a creamy pumpkin it's very nice. It comes with a little top, you know, that way your candle's not catching dust from the store. But yeah, and then the wicks, they kind of suck a little. Sometimes it depends. Um, the packaging is not cute, let's be real. Like I said, you can get yourself some candle holders to hide. Like I said, you can get yourself some candle holders to hide them. Um, it's not cute packaging. I think if they would remove all this crap, like USA, <laughs> like this label, um, the pictures are really cute, but like the wording and all that, like they just need to oh, this is easy peel. Oh, is this to take it off so that you're not complaining about it? It's not an easy peel. Ugh. That's not an easy peel. I just jacked it up. Liars. Anyway, this smells so delicious. Ugh, I could just, I want some pumpkin pie right now. All right, there's other ones. So if you guys want a part two video, let me know. I'll go buy all the ones that I that they have and I will show them to you but the next one that is food related <sighs> this one smells so good hold on give me a second I need to take this one smells so good this one is sugar I should show you all the packaging this one is sugar cookies and milk super yummy the color is like um, 
beige. I like how they like color coordinate everything. Sugar cookies and milk. It smells like cookies and milk. Wow. It smells like cookies and milk. Exactly. Like how do they do that? How do they do that? I don't know because I feel like I'm eating those wafers. You know the little vanilla wafers? Like those dipped in milk. I'm on keto right now, I cannot, I cannot be tempted. Okay, right, moving on. Are we gonna focus or are we not going to do that today? But yeah, they, I swear, they have like all the, um, all the scented ones, all the holiday flavor, flavors, holiday scented candles that Bath & Body has, that Bath & Body Works has. This next one that I'm gonna show you is called Vanilla Hurt. As you guys can see, it's a really nice brown shade. This one smells, exactly exactly like marshmallow fireside mm. this one smells exactly ig exactly like marshmallow fireside bath and body work marshmallow fireside that was my favorite candle until it just makes me profusely like drip from my nose makes my eyes watery rich it's gross but yeah this one oh my god it's so delicious it's vanilla her whatever that is what is her leave it in the comments below if you know all right next one is another all-time favorite this one's the one that's burning right now i freaking love this one i have it going on a lot at the salon because it is i mean it says what it that it mm, wow anyway the name explains it all is what my mouth is trying to say it's called cozy gatherings cozy gathering and it has like a sweater there and it has um like a cup of tea or coffee or whatever and that's exactly like it's just no so cozy <laughs> it, tastes good. Mm. it smells so good i can't describe it to be honest you're gonna have to go to walmart and take a sniff for yourself okay, next one is another one with the same word in it this one's cute i like the like i said if all this all these labels weren't all over this it would look super cute it has like knitted sweaters on there and it's a beige color and it is called cozy comfort oh my god this one kind of smells like cozy gathering but this one smells really clean this is like for your bathroom for your laundry room it smells like clean linen but not too sick like not too you know what i mean like there's i don't know i come across a lot of like Air fresheners that smell like linen and they smell disgusting to be honest. This one smells good. So good. Right next we have this pretty guy here. This one's blue. It's a really nice shade of light blue. And this one is called Country Holiday. And it just has like um, a table there or something or it's snow. And it has gifts and stuff. Oh, this one smells so good as well. It smells really clean. And how can I describe this one? It smells really clean, that's for sure. It smells like paper, like gift wrap. Almost like gift wrap, like snow, like gift wrapping, wrapping on snow. Yeah, like if, I swear, like the picture just explains it all. Like if you're just sitting outside, there's been a gift waiting for you, you know, packaged in the snow and then they kind of got a little damp from the snow but then you start smelling like the paper because it's kind of damp <sighs> it smells so good. It smells so good. okay this next one here is a pretty yellow shade looks like this and this one is called celebration and oh my gosh this one smells like freaking champagne and like colored lights i don't know how to explain what i'm trying to say it smells like you're at a Christmas party and there's just champagne everywhere and everybody's like getting lit up and like your Thea's about to start some shit with your other Thea and it's about to go down. That's what it smells like. Mmm, smells like <laughs> she about to throw wine in her face. <laughs> Alright, and the last one I have here I didn't think I was gonna like because I really didn't think I was gonna like this one because I'm not a pine cone type of person. Like I like pine cones, but I don't love them. Like I like Christmas trees, but I don't love the scent like of a real tree. But oh my gosh, I want all these pine cones in my house. This one smells like the picture. It's called pine cones and plaid. I don't know what plaid would smell like, but the wood basket that 
they are in kind of smell like cedar mm -hmm. like more cedar than pine cone so it just has like a little hint of pine cone like a little like if a little squirrel got a pine cone and he brought it over here and he put it in a little basket that's like very wood made and like there's heat and it's creating this smell and that's what it smells like like the little squirrel left its pine cone on the wood you know what i mean no but honestly it smells so good i can't wait to like this one on christmas day like this is the smell that i want i want everybody to smell for the pine cones like, I just want them. Okay, so that is it for this candle haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Let me know which one your favorite is and definitely let me know which one you'll be going to Walmart and picking up for yourselves because I would like to know. But yeah, let me know which one is your favorite candle in the comments down below for a secret giveaway. And um, whichever one you choose, if your number is chosen in the next video that I post, you will be the winner of one of these candles and I will mail it out to you. So thank you if you did watch the video all the way through. Um, I really do appreciate you guys. Yes, thank you for all the love and support. I really do see you guys. I see you comment. And um, yes, let me know what you want to see next. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by. Um, go ahead and subscribe if you do like my video. And hit the post notification button. Turn it on so that it notifies you every single time I upload a new video. And with that being said, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.